Well, hello everybody and welcome to episode number six of What You Doing? David Wood coming at you today. I've just poured my first cup of coffee in my State Farmers Market Restaurant Coffee Cup. I got on my Christmas Carol t-shirt. I'm down in my basement again and we've got a great episode for you. Lots of folks have sent in their videos. We appreciate it. If you haven't sent in your video yet and want to, please do. We will include it. So without further ado, I'm going to sip my coffee, sit back, and we're all going to find out what you doing. Hi, everybody. This is Derek. You probably, some of you probably know me as Renee Cadzo's father, who was in Christmas Carol back around the turn of the millennium. Um, what, are, what you doing? What am I doing? <laughs> we're dropping yarn all over the floor. And I'm helping Jackie get this all sorted out here, and I'm learning how to deal with this mound of yarn. Um, not something I'd be doing if we weren't stuck in the house. Um, I hope you all are staying safe. David, thank you for putting on this series. It's lots of fun, and uh, we'll see you on the flip side. Bye. Thank you. Hey there, all you cool cats and kittens. This is Carol, I mean Casey. I definitely do not have any tigers in my living room. Uh, just what you would call a living room tiger, actually a miniature-sized little house cat. Um, so uh, I have, how have I been keeping busy? Um, several things. I have been, uh, I'm very fortunate. I'm able to, to work remotely, which has been nice. Um, obviously doing some, some self care over here with those face masks. And, um, I've been coloring my little Disney princess coloring book. You guys like a five-year-old that I am. I broke out this bad boy, the Sega Dreamcast circa 90s, 2000s. That's been a lot of fun. Um, just living my best life and also a lot of you guys don't know this about me but i i used to play the electric guitar um so i thought i would i, I started taking lessons when i was 10 but i kind of that fell to the wayside i've been doing more um acting and singing but um i thought i would pick it back up and i'm really proud of the progress that i've progress that i've made i think that my technique has really improved i mean come on you guys like i'm pretty proud of just my work and my technique and just the the how far I've come so I just wanted to show that to you guys and that's why I've been keeping busy and I really think you know another couple days I think I'll be ready to do um, a virtual concert for you guys do some solos you know yeah looking forward to that so um take care hey David it's Brian Soderman coming to you from the front porch how's it going listen we're doing our part flattening the curve staying at home like everyone else and uh, you know it's going all right so far caroline has set up shop over in the uh dining room and she's zooming in and out of conferences all day and on the speaker phone with different conversations so that's been kind of interesting and uh, the kids are upstairs all day minding their own business so you know things are good as for me I try to get out to the practice space a little bit and play some drums and, you know, relieve some tension. I do miss my bandmates and I wish I was playing with them more, but, you know, it is what it is right now. Anyway, I hope everyone's safe on your end and everyone else is doing well as well. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye now! Hi everybody, it's Tatiana Guy and I just wanted to say a quick hello and let everybody know what I've been up to during this pandemic. Um, finding uh, a lot of therapy in walking every day. I have rediscovered our green way. Lots of time to reflect on those walks. I have been reading a lot and spending uh, every day in the yard um, battling the weeds and uh, I am winning, so yay. And also trying to keep in touch with my students, sending them choreography videos and music so that they can continue to practice uh, and hopefully we can have our show now in the fall. So um, I'm looking forward to the social distancing being lifted uh, so that we can spend time in person together and enjoy each other's company again. Um, oh yeah, one thing, um, has there been an update on David Moore uh, or does Carol still have him locked in the closet? Just wanting to know. 
Hey y'all, it's Chris. Um, what am I doing? Well, I could tell you that I've been sitting here consistent off of a diet of frozen pizzas and Oreos and no haircuts. That would be true. I could also tell you that I've been sitting here going crazy, being bored, getting really, really frustrated and wanting to choke out my dog, but that would be completely untrue. This is the best thing that's ever happened to me. There's nobody on the streets. There's nobody on the road. There's no one at the pharmacy. There is no one coming into my office, and no one's even really calling my office either. I am in heaven. I hope all of you are doing well, and we can all appreciate the fact that this really is a good thing. It's like when they come up to you and they say, hey, you don't have to be there for strike. Isn't that a nice feeling? Like my mama used to always say, y'all, <clears throat> just shut up and do it. You're going to be fine. Take care, y'all. Hey, everybody. What you doing, Laura? Well, um, I am still working. Our child care center is open. And um, so I'm just still doing the teacher thing. Some of us are working on campus at the school, and some of us are working from home. Um, I'm doing both since we can only have a certain number of people at the school at the same time. So um, when I'm home, I'm doing home assignments, and we're sending in videos for the kids and doing Zoom calls with the kids. I have one tomorrow morning with my preschool class in the preschool house and that's so fun because they can feel engaged and um, connected to us and to their friends and see each other and it's super cute. When I'm not working, I am working out because you know I go crazy if I don't have my group fitness classes. So I'm so thankful my Zumba instructor is doing Zoom Zumba twice a week and then the other times I'm just finding some um, online videos of body pump and body attack and doing those so it's just fun enjoying that um, I hope you're all safe and having a good time with each other and just loving on each other. Um, I know this is a confusing and weird and uncertain time, but we can always find the blessings and the gifts and all that, and I pray that you all are doing that as well. Um, I miss you all. I can't wait to hug you when I see you. Um, we will see each other soon, so hang in there and just breathe and know that I love you. And we'll see each other soon. Love y'all. Bye. Hey there. I'm Vincent Jenna, or more commonly known as Vinny among my theater family. And I was asked to share what I'm doing during this stay at home crisis. Well, there's a lot of things. See, I'm a spiritual teacher and a mystic healer. So I've been really busy with sessions on the phone with clients. I've done a ton of radio interviews and I'm really trying to help inspire people. I've been creating classes for those who want to use this time to grow or get to the next level in their lives so they can pursue their dreams when this is all over. And on top of that, now this is really important and I want you guys to listen to this, exercise and taking care of your health at home is real important. Now I've been going to the gym a lot, so I don't want to lose any of those gains. So, so I've been doing some, I found these bands that we had, and I've been doing these exercises at home. So that way I can keep my muscles worked up. You really want to do something to, to fire those muscles and increase your energy and things like that. So, so I've been using these bands and, and, you, and you, you, you want to work your muscles hard. You, you want to really get into moving. <laughs> uh, well, uh, yeah, maybe you don't want to work that hard. <laughs> so, um, um, I think I've got to decrease the resistance on these. Well, we'll do that later. So remember, whatever you do, you want to keep working your body, your mind, and your spirit. Do something that's really healthy and helpful, and you'll be able to get through this. We will, and we'll see each other in the theater again. So thanks for letting me share, and you take care. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Rebecca Lumsden, Christmas Carol person from years ago. Anyway, I am quarantined here at the beach, 
And some of the things I've been doing are, well, today, being the Southern girl that I am, I boiled peanuts. I love boiled peanuts. It could be I'm from South Carolina and we love them more than people from North Carolina. But I love boiled peanuts and where, Lucy, come here Lucy, Lucy. Well yesterday, here she is, I gave my puppy dog Lucy, say hi, say hi darling, can you sit there, look at this way, say hi, this is Lucy, she's a rescue, and I gave her a bath yesterday, didn't I, we had a bath, yes we did. So, now, so today, this is my next project, and it's probably going to take me the rest of my life. I'm going to try to do this paint by number of this cow. So I started filling in this area first, and then I realized, oh, well, that's not very smart. So I'm going around and doing the edges. So, all right. So, anyway, I hope that everyone is staying safe. And I look forward to seeing videos from you. Thanks, David, for doing this. It's a lot of fun. Bye. Oh, hello. Hi, everyone. I miss y'all so much. I'm just, you know, hunkered down until this thing blows over. <laughs> but don't worry, I've got my mask. I'll see y'all soon. Okay. Hi, David. I'm going to turn this around like this. Hi. If you can see me, I don't know how to flip the phone around, but this is Stephanie calling from Palm Springs, California, rainy California for five days. It's been great. But I want to participate in your what are you doing program. So I'm going to flip the phone around and talk while, um, while I show you. Uh, there's a project called CV Mass Project here in Palm Springs. It stands for Coachella Valley. And uh, they have had a, a team of cutters, pattern makers, cutters, and putting into kits. And then people like me build the, the stuff. 200. I'm on my number 200 gown. So this is kind of what it looks like. There's 10 there. 10 and then another 10 and this is 10 that I haven't folded up yet and this is my last one Woohoo! 200 and this is my little sewing machine it has been busy 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 going you can always trust singer so um everybody stay safe stay in love and wash your hands don't go out stay Stay cool, okay, bye. And there you have it, episode six. Thank you all for stopping by. Stay home, stay safe, stay well, stay happy. This is David Woods signing off.